Hey yo, what's up? Moji here and welcome to day 7 of Lightsome Week. So I was actually trying to choose what to uh, to react to for this last day of Lightsome Week and I ended up choosing something that I would probably relate to a little bit more. Uh, well, more or less. Anyways, today we're going to be checking out uh, can Lightsome understand each other speaking Tagalog on Mindlink? And so, as some of you may or may not know, I am Filipino, of, uh, which means, well, I can understand Tagalog. Although, to be honest, English is actually more of my first language. That's, um, what, I, that's what I grew up speaking. And, but well, of course... Having lived here in the Philippines for how many years now, I'm I'm quite comfortable with Tagalog as well. Although just more of the casual level of speaking Tagalog. If it comes to some of the deeper words, I probably won't be able to get it. Anyways, we'll see what they will use here in this video. And yeah, let's go right ahead and check it out. Here we go. 제가 연습생을 하면서 와 내가 꼰대가 됐구나를 느낀 순간 아 그럼 많았잖아 그런 적 오케이 시연이가 많았다 했어 so it, I think this will be something like they're sharing something related to them but using some Tagalog words so the other members have to guess I think that's that's usually how it goes in in other variety spots similar to this Okay, Sanga first. An honor, but. Okay. Um. By the way, I'm going to be translating. Uh, the words right away. So if you wanted to guess, uh, the words along with the other members of Lightsum, this video probably isn't for you. Uh, if you want to make this sort of a game maybe you can guess who will be able to get the translation <laughs> anyways hindi ko mapapantayan means like i cannot reach their level and by the way sanga's pronunciation was kind of on point there really nice visual ting 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 ah visual so that's in context of comparing her to Jenny from Blackpink. Unacceptable visual beauty. Can't agree. Can't help but admire. No. Unapproachable. Yeah, it could be that. It's an honor, but Jenny has unapproachable visual beauty. So people compare her to Jenny? Maybe the whole image. Okay. <laughs> kind of embarrassed by it. I'm more talented than Okay, pretty good as well. Oh, there's another one. Okay, so I'm more talented at Magpamalas ng emotion is show off my emotions express my emotions i'm not quite sure <laughs> then because i like sanay ng mabuti means like i i practice thoroughly or i practice well or, or maybe in context it could just mean i practice a lot anyways let's see who'll get it <laughs> Actually more talented. Not dance. 
표정 연기. 귀엽기 때문에. Expression acting. <웃음> Could be expression acting. Like acting out the expressions. 표정 연기에 더 소질 있다. 열심히 연습하기 때문이다. Oh, Sangha got it. 그 이번에 바닐라 하면서 흙으로 바뀔 때그 표정 변화를 팬분들이 많이 좋아해 주셔서 제가 그 부분을 가장 많이 연습했기 때문에 좋았거든요. 약간 Demonstration, please. 그러니까 노래 불러주실래요? 네. 둘셋 Oh my god 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 Oh my 가장 힘들었던 경험은 스케이팅 말라낀다와 빠르게 빠질로이 뛰었어. 오케이. Okay. I was good thing I was listening to how Huyen was saying it because she said 피나카 말라킹 라와. Because I and that makes much more sense to me because I don't know what the heck malting is. It's like malting. <laughs> but uh, I'm I'm inclined to think what Huyun read out loud is more accurate. So it's supposed to be pinaka malaking lawa, which is like the biggest lake or biggest pond. But if you're skating, I imagine it wouldn't be on a lake. So it's probably the biggest pond. And then patuloy means continuously. So she had to run the biggest lake, uh, the biggest pond continuously real fast. <laughs> a double accent. <laughs> Random word. On ice now. Continuously? Okay, she got continuously. Huge ice rink? No. Lake? Ocean? <laughs> so I skate on the ocean. Oh, Julian got it. Huge pond. <laughs> 가장 힘들었던 경험은 연못 주변을 계속 뛰었던 경험이다. 대단하다. 체력을 키우려고. 체력 키우려고 그래서 여름에 막 The build strength. 근데 울었어요. Oh, he cried. 자전거 타시고. Her coach was on a bicycle. 나는 뛰고. 얄미웠구나. 맞아요. 아, 이것은? As a child actor. 음료수 광고를 찍으며. With the beverage app? Wait, wait. I I actually don't know what Maali Wallace translates to. Like I know what it sort of means in context. Kinda like Bright, clean, clear. Brightness? Cleanliness? How would you translate that? Anyways. It's Sangha with Chowon. <laughs> not with them. It's with one of them. <laughs> but not Sangha or Chowon. <laughs> with Hina. Refreshing? Show off our refreshing side. Okay. So it could be translated that way, huh? It kind of works. Refreshing. 
코스메틱이나 약간 의류나 이런 거 정말 찍어보고 싶어요. 이런 거 하면. <웃음> 시트콤 액팅 템 파탈 베로나 블라인드 뭐야 왜 이거 저 뭐야 뭐야 초코유로 왜 석훈이죠 고마운 일이 있어서 주는 거야 고마운 일? 어이 상실이네 너 주석훈 좋아하냐? 아 좋아하냐? 고맙다 베로나 잘 먹을게 뭐야 오빠 여기 나 영어 수 점심 <laughs> Extreme soap opera. <laughs> yeah, Yujong didn't even get to say anything there. <laughs> Took away all her lines. He's supposed to be the the one jealous of uh, Jian in that one. Okay. Uh, Jian's pronunciation is quite good as well. Hanggang makita ang singaw sa buong salamin. I think that probably means like they practiced until they can see the fog in the mirror. Practice rooms usually have a, have mirrors, right? So basically, they practiced so hard they heated up the air and caused the mirror to fog up. But like an oldie who knows a trainee. <laughs> 주연이가 많았다 했어 나한테 막내야 에어컨 켜 라고 말해 주연이 몰아가기다 몰아가기 막내야 에어컨 꺼 춤출 때 어떻게 해야 약간 와 진짜 열심히 했다 이걸 약간 느끼고 거울이 뿌얘질 때 Until the mirror's fogged up 뿌얘질 때까지 했었거든요 맞아요 맞아요 그 말만 잘 약간 이렇게 하면 돼 거울에 김 생길 때까지 오 거울입니다 와 Nayang got the correct um, wording. Quick or slow at learning new choreography. Oh, none of them are slow. Is that like a group flex? Oh, but they're in trouble once the concentration goes. 약간 주연 언니가 뭔가 그 마지막이야 라고 말할 때 진짜 제가 약, 우리끼리 약간 그런 밀당하듯이 지쳤다 하면은 이제 이번에 잘하면 끝낼게요 라는 말만 하면 주문처럼 엄청 잘해요 <웃음> A generation gap with the members 앱을 몰라서 라트 했다 오케이 아 sorry so, the members didn't know the Uso is something like popular or trending, uh, popular apps. So I was, Gulat is surprised, either surprised or shocked, depending how you translate it. 요즘 유행하는 앱을 몰라서 검색했다. 네. So I looked it up. 유행도 아닌가요? No. 유행 맞아요. Popular is correct. 유행하는 앱을 몰라서 놀렸다. 한심했다. You teased them. You <웃음> seem pathetic. 어, 맞아요. I was surprised. Wait, who got that? 놀랐다. 어, 맞아요. You drunk? You drunk so who got that? 저는 제 동생이랑 동갑이었어 가지고 맨 처음에. <웃음> Oh yeah, if you have a younger sibling that's the same age as someone else, you feel like, yeah, they're in a different generation. Okay, pretty good pronunciation as well. But this is kind of sad. During vacations, other members get to go home. And I didn't go home. Because... Yeah, Tina is from Japan. In one try? Tian got it. <laughs> and they all got bummed out. <laughs> Come to my house. <laughs> Just knew they were gonna play that song. 
저번 일이 하루 휴가 때. 지안이 집으로 놀러 갔어. 내 휴가 때마다 한번 이렇게 골라. 그래서 오늘은 여기, 오늘은 저기. It's like other on the member's houses. Oh, there's more. Ina ko matagal na pagsasanay. Tengtengi wa tengtenga. Kajang mani nakatulong. Okay. So the members who practice the longest, ina ko matagal na pagsasanay. Yeah, practice the longest. Help. Helped out the most. Nakatulong is help. Fought the most. Christ the most. Biggest bully. Help me the most. Jeyeon and Sangha. They practice the most. Jeyeon and Sangha help the most. Nayan got it. Who practiced the longest helped me the most. Hyun and Hina. 계속 쏟는 건 약간 히나 같고 수연이는 약간 자주 쏟는 느낌. 어 히나 cries longer. 수연 cries more often. 히나 뭐해 이러고 울고 계속 우니까 어 너무 힘들다 울면서 자기도 숨못 쉬게. So exhausting. 수연이 뭐해 언니 막 이러면서 울고 둘다 진짜 귀엽게 울어요. 오늘 이 마인드 링크를 통해 모르던 사실을 안 것도 있고 한데요. 저도 이렇게 공개적으로 고백을 할 줄은 몰랐지만 또 이런 시간 아니면 언제 해보겠어요? 맞아. I'm also learning more new things about them. 해주시면 좋겠다고 해줘서 감정 받았잖아요. 멤버들이 어떻게 생각해주고 있는지 알수 있는 시간이었어서 너무 좋았던 것 같습니다. 맞아요. 지금까지 라이썸의 마인드 링크였습니다. Okay, I think that's it. So that was uh, can light some understand each other speaking Tagalog on Mindlink, and so we learned quite a bit about uh, light some in this well uh, variety spot variety segment, and well. Uh, it's just uh, another great experience to have uh, reacting to light some content and we learned quite a bit you know that uh, like like how uh, Sangha keeps getting compared to Jenny of Blackpink but that her uh, her actual idols are Suzy and CL and um, what else did we learn? Like, I learned that Maliwalas can be translated as refreshing. <laughs> oh, and that Yu Jong is apparently a child actor and has experience acting as a child. And so uh, she has this dream of shooting a beverage ad. And then. Uh, and the fact that uh, Joyeon and Sangha uh, were really, really helpful to Chowon during their pre-debut period while they were uh, preparing, preparing for their debut. And just all around, just like, it's nice to see uh, how being together in this group uh has made them all you know very close to each other just like uh sort of like a family and yeah this these kinds of variety segments uh i really i really like watching them because you get to see like the 
the interactions between the members, getting to know a bit more about uh, about the the members through stuff that they reveal. <laughs> oh, I also like the 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 kind of group flex that <laughs> that uh, Julian expressed earlier that no one is slow at learning choreography. We are all at a similar pace. <laughs> And that's actually really great. And yeah, that's there's there's quite a bit in this uh in this variety segment that uh was really really wonderful to watch. Anyways, uh, I think that's it for my reaction to can light some understand each other speaking Tagalog on Mindlink and well, we'll see what else we're going to be covering from them in the future. I actually have a bunch of other videos lined up that I will react to uh, from Lightsome. So you can probably expect to see some of those pop up in the next week or so. And yeah, that's the end of Lightsome week. So tomorrow, we're going to be starting on the fourth group. Some of you might have guessed who that group might be, although I I don't think I've seen anyone comment uh, if they've actually guessed it. But the major clue about that group is that, well, their comeback is on Monday. <laughs> and so I'll be just in time to start covering them tomorrow. And then on Monday, we'll be right there for their comeback. And yeah, I'm quite excited for next week as well. And since I've decided to just put out all like the extra content, like ex extra reactions to um, to I've the new jeans to light some, just alongside whatever group I'm doing for the week, then that means I can just keep doing these uh group of the week reactions as well so after next week i will be releasing another teaser announcement for the next four groups that i'm going to be covering although those next four groups might be uh the last new groups i'll be covering for a while since i'm already getting so much uh, so many groups already into my uh into my list of groups that i follow so i probably won't be doing uh too many new groups after the next four depends though uh i think there's a group that i will add though because they are well there are some new groups debuting that I'll probably add just like as extra content. Anyways, I believe that's it. Let's close out Light Some Week. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, feel free to check out my Patreon where I also post reactions to some longer form content, more casual content, and most of which is available for free with some bonus perks available for those who are kind enough to subscribe. Anyways, you can go and go ahead and check out my Patreon. The link to it is in my description down below. Also, if you're into gaming content, you can catch me on Twitch from time to time, playing Genshin Impact and Tower Fantasy while vibing to the K-pop playlist of songs I have covered so far in this YouTube channel. So if you're interested in that, uh, the details of my Twitch are also in the description down below. So thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much on jo for joining me on this wonderful magical journey through light some week. And well, until next time, have a great day, everyone. And hope to see you guys in the next video.
Bye for now.